Nice pass, leaving an open Michaela Ferenz, and she makes the Lumberjacks pay. Good ball movement by the Vandals. Uh, knocked down some big shots just like that, and uh, what a freshman. Uh, quick shooter and uh, shows no fear at all. The true freshman out of Buckeye had 15 points Thursday night, and Idaho starting to heat up a little bit from behind the arc. Another player off the bench left last Thursday night that uh, came in and made some big shots when the Lumberjacks needed the most. Ferenz once again getting that one to go. We're just going to trade threes here, aren't we? Deep three by Ferenz gets that to go, ending a three-minute scoring drought. Jacks this evening. Good defense there by Olivia Lucero. Pierce, though, gets a bit of space and nails it when these Idaho van lock down. Five to go. Ferenz getting away with a bit of a travel. Pierce straightaway three-pointer gets it to go. And Idaho, credit to the Vandals. They keep clawing, they keep fighting their way back in that bound. Ferenz in transition. Michaela Ferenz now with... Lumberjack's a little colder in this quarter. Again, the Vandals uh, continue to look for three. And they continue to nail them. <laughs> Michaela Ferenz in front of them a lot of times, easy to call. Now, in all of your years of coaching, has arguing a call ever got it reversed? Have you ever seen that? No, <laughs> I don't think so. Although, with the replay. That's the largest Vandal lead of the evening. For Renz from four feet behind the arc, it doesn't matter. And Robin Bostick and the Lumberjacks need a timeout as they now trail the team in the, in the Idaho Vandals. Corner three gets that to go. Bethany Krause. Every night, uh, you're going to come out with some wins. It's Pierce for three. A nice set play by Coach. And, uh, get a stop right here. Off of the timeout, it's Winger now with six seconds on the shot clock. Krause with it, goes in the corner to Geraldine McCorkle. And that one hurts the Lumberjacks. Yeah, good penetration.